What follows is the most thorough and accurate account of the city and people of Baldur's Gate, the sordid gem of the Sword Coast. An editor's note in Crimson Inc. as follows. Volo. This volume is startlingly accurate, save for the nonsense about the Black Dragon Gate. It is not alive, no matter how many vagrant hags claim otherwise. Commission someone else to draw the map. Alright, my stealthing has taken a somewhat different form. Oral histories of Faerun Paladin Oathbreakers. Bank, Why, yes. chalk, and lump the enlightened. Oh my god, some of these are big. This book is comprised of several chapters, one for each cited source. It claims to contain first-hand transcriptions of the oral histories of several storytellers throughout the realm. Valimar the Outcast, 52 years old. Given Valimar's reputation in Athkatla, the city she once called home, I met the former knight officer of the noble and ex exclusive Order of the Radiant Heart with no small amount of trepidation. She has lived as an outcast for some years now, and the rumors of her character quite preceded her. I spoke to one of the prelates of the Order, who described her as a dreadful sadistic traitor, warning me that to find her would be suicide, that she would kill me before I could speak a single word. He was wrong. When I finally tracked her down, we spoke for hours, and I left with her blessing to share her story. I will not disclose our meeting place, as the Order punishes those who violate their vows with beheading. Of course I regret it. Breaking an oath isn't going back on your word. It's not an ethical quandary. It wrenches out part of your soul. Before, I could call on angels to fight alongside me. I could banish fiends back to the hells and demons to the abyss. All with a thought and a prayer. I lost my voice. I speak, but this isn't my voice. It's an echo, a whisper. Tell them this. Most days I wish I died rather than breaking my oath. But I'd never take back what I did, what I refused to do. Damn the order. Service became dogma. Obedience was virtue. To question was sin. Justice and duty are uncomfortable bedfellows, and eventually they make bastards of us all. Pretty neat. Gay teachers. Dear Flora, happy birthday. I know. I finally finished a painting, and not just any painting. Look familiar? Oop. I'll give you a hint. It involved me getting down on one knee, and you making me the happiest woman alive. I'd best go. I hear silence in the, in the classroom next door, and it's never a good sign. Happy birthday, my <laughs> love, Amanda. What happened? I noticed that there is some. There is a weak. Uh, there's a weak bar, oh. I guess, in here. Considering collapsing the the ceiling on them. Not yet. It's right next to where you are, though. Yeah, so it's be right careful. under me. Oh, sorry. I keep I keep holding down Alt to uh to see what is interactable. The boy in the beholder. All right. There are goblins patrolling, by the way, outside. Yeah, all over. Goblin Brawlers. The house next door. Wow. Okay, yeah, this 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 village in general is just huge. Oh. Uh Thank you. It's hard to be sure from what I think I'm seeing here, but I think they attached a gnome to the windmill and are throwing rocks at him. Oh no. <laughs> Let's see. Uh you killed the you killed the first guard? I killed one of them, yeah. CRPG stealth always stresses me out. Just the idea of having to like click it all through right and know the exact sequence and not just slightly mess the whole thing up and then it's, then then you're in the open. Let's see. All right, I definitely want to get into some of these chests and stuff. Oh, another waypoint. 
Nothing in there. Another butthole for the collection. Lock pick. This place is packed with bottles. Oof. <laughs> Deliver especially requested plants to seller. Keep away from prying eyes. There's a cellar here somewhere. So there's a cellar somewhere around here, but just these. Sh this place is just full of alchemy stuff looking. Looks just in general. Mugwort. Oh man. That is really useful. Yeah. Oof, that made me that made me nervous. This room's very abruptly not empty. Glows marked on their flesh, and something within you stirs in response. Don't use the illithid one. <laughs> Persuasion. Yeah. Or deception. I'm not sure which one is better for, for Asterian. What? The god let me pass. Ooh. Did you just barely scrape by? Uh, one by two. Hey. Nice. Then you got business need seeing to, don't you? Go on. Lads were gathered near the windmill last I looked. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Charlatan just passing through. That gives me some inspiration. Can I now just walk around safely or did I only fool one guard? Unclear. Oop. Okay, I found the cellar. What's in here? I am currently looting stuff. There is a guard back here, a goblin tracker. Can I kill them? Oh, I sure can. They do not see me. Temporary hostile where? What does that mean? I have no idea. I'm not in combat, so. It's very strange to loot. Uh, oh, are they investigating? Books. Are they trying to figure out where I am? That's fun. Like it's an alert state because they see. found someone you killed. There are, no, there are two on top of the building, and it doesn't seem like they know where I am. Aha, uh -huh. so they're temporarily hostile. Interesting. Temporarily hostile. It's like, weave oh, moss, me, autumn cross, belladonna, garlic. You can knock out or flee from temporary hostile enemy and return later. Will do. Suspicious poison. Bye. All right, I escaped the battle. Mm -hmm. I don't think they're going to be able to follow me. Deflect missiles, sure, they can try. Samson had gout. Branley had splinters. 
Timic swallowed a bottle cork. Dita had burns on their hand. It's just a record of people being cared for here. What have you perceived? A secret lover. Hey, I found a dog. Okay. All right, I am out of the village completely. I had to run, so uh, let me know when I am I am capable of talking to a dog. <laughs> Unless you want to come to where I am and talk to a dog. Oh, that's a dog. So you're over there. God, where even and is that? And there's a dead person, so... Uh, wait, uh... Um... Select you... Has Laz Lazel been with you the whole time? Uh, I haven't. Uh, I've been. I've been. I mean, I've been exploring the town as 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 a the Syrian. rogue. And I don't, gotcha. I've just been having my my. Okay, what am I? I'm not looking. Is my screen okay? Oh fuck! Oh fuck! He passed into town. Okay. Uh, I mean, that's I, fine. I think we're allowed to be here because we passed those checks. Maybe. I, uh, I was trying to figure out how to get to you. Let's see. Like, I, I really struggle at telling where anything is in relation to anything else in this in this map. Okay, wait, I can teleport places. Where do I want to teleport? Waypoint camp. Overgrown ruins, roadside cliffs, emerald. Oh, I understand that system now. Nope, that's a passed out bugbear. Puppy. Hey, Scratch. Uh oh. Keep moving, stranger. Quietly. What happened here? I told you to go. Here it is, color. I don't want to threaten a dog. <laughs> Let's take a look at his collar. Maybe. Uh, this is the dialogue choice I'd pick if if I were gonna pick a dialogue choice, but I'm just I'm worried that only Oh, it has advantage though. Yeah. Okay, so it doesn't matter that's only plus one. I understand your fear, but I promise I mean you no harm. Double dice! Still almost failed. <laughs> oh my god. It's a hard difficulty check. It's not trust not a trusting dog. Nice. Mm. There's death in your scent, but not in your words. Still, you should go. My friend is injured. He needs rest. Oh. <laughs> uh, I don't think he's going to wake up. Of course he will. And then we'll return home. Oop, I did not mean to select that. Prove the man is dead, shout at his corpse. Uh, what is your name? He calls me Scratch. You can do the same. What happened to your friend exactly? We were attacked. The cackling, furry things on two legs. And their smell. It was strange, rotten, evil. Nope, failed mm. it. Could have been bugbears. Oh, it was gnolls. Yeah. Because gnolls are evil in this universe. And stinky. Which, which is rude. Come on. 
You can travel with me if you like. No, I won't leave any. If he doesn't wake up, follow my sense. I have a camp. If it comes Ooh. to that, I may. Thank you. Sad donkey, no. <laughs> Alright. This is just tragic. Okay, so the gnolls are definitely nearby then. Yeah. They've been incredibly frequently reinforced as a nearby threat. I'm gonna go back to what I was doing with Estarian real quick, just because I found a secret passage in, in the cellar. And I need to know. I'm just regrouping. I'm, I'm grouping up. There are NPCs talking over here, I think. Don't linger. Oh shit, did I not go to the right place? Oh no, I did. I just snuck passage. out of town with Lazel, so... Where does this passage lead? Oh. I'd be worried about that save. Oh, a bullywug trumpet's just a mushroom? It's not a, a trumpet? <laughs> There's definitely a dirt mound here. Oh, come on, Lazel. You can do better than that, girl. Come on. A dead boar. I'll use one of her inspirations. Look like it's been touched by scavengers. 19, baby, let's go. Dirty 20. You couldn't figure out what's going on with it? The carcass seems to be fresh, only a few hours dead. You notice two small puncture wounds in its neck. The vampires. Looking closer, you can see the skin around its face is desiccated. It's been completely drained of blood. Is it Asterian? Or is it... Uh, <laughs> is the, the absolute vampire? Asterian would never. Why would you think that? Oh, castle. Ah! What? Uh, oh! Surprised. You gotta run, dude. Yeah, book it. These are surprise <laughs> uh, undead exploding out of this. Mm -hmm. Oh, this whole room is full of caskets. Oh. Think I can run through that mirror? Do <laughs> you think that mirror is a, a teleporter? <laughs> uh. This is not ideal. Okay. I'm in danger. I'm gonna die. <laughs> okay. I am cartoonishly endangered right now. <laughs> I'm with your other dude, so I don't think there's gonna be a way for us to get there by the time that round happens. <laughs> it's, uh... It is comical how bad that got that quickly. Yep. Jesus. Nope. That was catastrophic. Yeah. I was just poking at a series of secrets and then, surprise, there's a ghoul thingy in a coffin that explodes out when you look at it. And then he just starts breaking all the other coffins to let more of them out. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> It's just looting. We've been doing this all game. How is this a problem? <laughs> all right. If we reload, I'll have to redo the 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 pig roll. But maybe it's best to pull Asterian out of there so that we can regroup. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to load. How long ago was this? Uh, Not that long. Like just five a few minutes, minutes ago. ago. Isn't it? All right, it's because I it saved when I was walking in. Yep. <clears throat> Brutal. That's dope. 
<laughs> that was. Uh, I dig that. All right, I'm gonna try to to do the pig thing again. Oh. Huh. Probably shouldn't have said hi to that. <laughs> Are you seeing this? Yeah, I am. Okay. I'm, uh... Ara Silverleaf. I do not know this name. If you are known to my master, step forward and declare yourself an ally. Um... Hmm. Yes, an ally. I'm an ally of your masters. Only a true ally of Illentoth may pass. What think you of the Zolkir known as Zastan? Ah, uh, <laughs> I don't know who that is. <laughs> and I failed my history check. <laughs> uh... I'm, I'm guessing mm. it's, it's gonna be it's a trick question. It's gotta be right. Flattery mm. won't get you anywhere. Says Tam is a foul, wretched creature. You are no soldier, but are you wise? Tell me, why might one use balsam ointment? Ah. Uh. Mm. I read a doctor's journal. He used balsam to clean a wound. Acceptable. Finally. Okay. <laughs> if you could see anything in me, what would it be? I genuinely did find that journal on the way in. Uh. 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 You could see anything mm. in me. My that home, third my one. My real home. Kazador, my old master, burning in the sun. Okay, so yeah, vampire. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Huh. This is a trick. Is this a test also? No, I think this is something that's being granted to us by the, yeah. the mirror. I see Kazador, my old master, burning in the sun. Pathetic. A poor choice. No, it's a test. Oh, it was a test. Eerie. <laughs> what? What the fuck is? Oh, 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 oh. Okay, time to leave. Time to leave. I have to do a medicine roll again just to get whatever that thing that we just saw. Oh, I'm running I got to away. keep my... Alright, just skip that because we already saw it. I closed the lever back up. Uh, <laughs> I just closed the door back you up. You just fled. You're just yes. fleeing. <laughs> yes, the, yes. It went bad. This no, is funny. I don't, I don't think you saw what happened because you because you just saw dialogue, but fucking yeah, it just pulled me into dialogue. Yeah, a metal sphere s ha hovered straight out of it, and then just started exploding <laughs> all over, over and over again, <laughs> and wandering around that the room right. exploding. And I'm like, uh, even if it hasn't immediately <laughs> taken me out, that is going to break every coffin. <laughs> yeah, it just started just randomly exploding around the room. That's their security system. So dumb. You should, uh, when you get back, you should take Wolfthorn and read the notes on Gomwick's body and see if it uh, changes any of your interactions with the dog. Read the note on his body? He has three on his body. Let's see. I was afraid of messing with the body. He doesn't mind. I already looted it. Gomwuk, be doubly careful on the way back to Baldur's Gate. I received more reports of attacks on travelers throughout the region. I can't have my best messenger winding up face down in a ditch somewhere. 
Watch yourself. Better late than never. Postman, Postmaster General Danzo. Davin. It's a boy. He's healthy and perfect. I named it after his father. Come back and see us as soon as we can get leave. Flora. Oh. Isn't Flora the person who wrote that other letter? Yeah. Nine fingers. I won't come back into the city. Not while you have your thugs looking for me. If you want the debt paid, you'll have to trust me and, and collect it to yourself. Go to the graveyard and look for where a M. Kirwan is buried. Get digging and you'll find enough valuables to settle matters between us. Don't go looking for me. I'll know when I'm safe. Go on. If he doesn't wait, I'll find you. Nope, no dialogue. All right, well, I guess that's it. All right. Huh, I found another path over here that leads to what looks like, uh, oh, a place where a lot of people have died. Good to know. That's a good sign. It means we're close to people, which means we're close to civilization. Yeah. Isn't that, isn't that our goal? Oh, okay, people? hold on. Carlac, who is this? Isn't this the person? Oh, isn't this the person that... Uh, what's his face that he wanted to kill? Uh... Where are you? Shit. Uh... I just exited the other side of oh, where there. the dog was. Yeah, our, our guy's hunting for them. Looks like she has handcuffs. Kinky. Oh my god, that hat. This is the devil Will has been tasked to kill. Hmm. I know you. You're the devil the Blade of Frontiers is hunting. Gods. Is he still on my tail? <laughs> I'm embarrassed for him. I have never he was seen the so-called paladins of Tear <laughs> straight from the Grand High Devil herself. I have never seen a character that is more kettle chips coded than this character. <laughs> <laughs> it's very funny. Uh, this are barely, off in the comments these barely below counts kettle. as clothes. <laughs> Okay. Uh, oh my god, the beating fire heart. Mm. Oh, that is badass. I didn't even notice that. This character is so much. You can barely call what she's wearing clothes, like just like a series of straps suggesting the shape of what could be a top. <laughs> <laughs> Seems like you have a lot of enemies. Nothing but. But maybe you don't need to be one of them. You're no bounty hunter. I saw you before. On the Mind Flayer's ship. A great heat roars through you. Oh shit. Her heat, fiery as the hells. Then you're lost in visions of demonic armies as you tear through a landscape of fire and blood. Wait, is she a party member? You saw it from above as the Nautiloid passed through Avernus. This woman was on the front line. What? How did she know? Oh, because we picked some up. Interesting. So he and the person he was hunting were both on the ship? Yeah, they both got picked up. Mm. Going into a small world with these people. You're a devil then, a soldier in the blood war. Not by choice. I'm a good skull crusher, but I never wanted to serve Zariel. From that peak I got into your head, I'm not the only one with problems on top of problems. A mind flare tadpole, huh? And no joy getting it sorted as of yet, I see. I'm Karlak. And you are. Hmm. I'm Kanth. Well met, soldier. Now that we're old pals, how would you feel about helping me kill some evil bastards? A little background, if your moral compass needs something to point at. Unexpected. You know I fought in the Blood War. I was good at killing demons. Really good. So good, Zariel, the archdevil herself, made me her personal attack dog. I 
played along until I could get the fuck out of there. It took me ten years to probably escape, but now I'm free. Zariel sent goon after goon to hunt me down. But believe me when I tell you, I'm not going. The latest yappy little dog she sicked on me are nearby. A group of dopes posing as paladins of tear. Want to help me take them down? Oh, hell yeah. Is it, what happens if she goes back to camp? Yeah. <laughs> so you want me to kill the people hunting you? Don't worry. I'll lead the charge. But I could use your help. There's a lot of them, and only one of me. After that, we can team up. Take Faerun by the short hairs. Sound good? A warrior who winks at her foes while she slays them. You'd be a fool to refuse her. Is Lazel horny for Karlak? <laughs> 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 oh, hell yeah. Oh, fuck yeah. Let's do it. Fuck yes. They cornered me outside oh. the toll house just up the hill. Don't they've gone far after the scorching I gave them. Hang on, though. Looks like you've got enough backup at your side. Not sure there's room for me. I'll catch up with you when it's time to camp for now. But don't get to any of the fun stuff without me. Oh, Got it? that can't be good. This character is clicking so on the good. camp button. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, I like this lady. Let's see. I can, uh, I could add her to my party if you want. Uh, I mean, if you want, if you want to bench Asterion for a while, and then while we maybe go over Carlyle. here and do this, we could. But I was worried what that her coming cool to back character. to camp would be bad. You we were a strange band, but a fugitive from the hills. <laughs> now that's someone worth knowing. Not that I want to get on the wrong side of any devils, but this Carlac is a survivor. Plus, I appreciate anyone who opens a conversation with threats of bodily harm. Go ahead and stay. Uh, darling, I'm hurt. Oh, here's something special. Ah, I guess I'll just relax and be gay. Anyway. Give, give me a moment. What do you for? Oh. oh. I was gonna go to camp, too. Fuck. Well, now we're here. <laughs> In your expert opinion, what's the best way to kill a devil? <laughs> Depends on the type. Ice devils hate an inferno, but that's an easy one. Orthons love projectiles. What they don't love is getting their bombs lobbed right back in their faces. Demons, on the other hand, every demon is absolutely singular. You can't ever think you've gotten typed out. Sharp instincts, sharp weapons, and a knack for improvisation. That's the only way to survive them. <laughs> anyway, what were we talking about? <laughs> Oh, this character kicks so much ass. Yeah. About those paladins you want us to confront. Yeah, let's go straight there. Whatever those fucks are getting up to, it's nothing good. Just to say, by the way, they're not really paladins. Lackeys of the Archdevil playing dress up as paladins of Tyr. No honor among devils. This isn't where I thought I'd end up. How about you? <laughs> Funny you should ask. I was just thinking about what would have become of us without that Nautiloid. I mean, I know where I'd be. Trapped in Avernus still, with the Blade of Frontiers on my tail. But what about you? Hmm. Be in the middle of another adventure, blessedly free of any tadpole. I can picture you getting mixed up in some outrageous shit. Giants, beholders, <laughs> Thayans, the works. Super Thayans. Maybe once we've wrapped up the current shenanigans, we'll rest a bit and find some new heap of troubles to throw ourselves at. We became best friends in five seconds flat. What can I do you for? Didn't actually join my party though, come on. Fuck yes. Fuck yes. <laughs> okay, I would actually love her. I've been I was in the blood war for one billion years, which is why I'm level one now. <laughs> <laughs> Normal video games. Danger sense. You have an advantage and on dexterity saving throws against traps, spells, and surfaces. Neat. Damn. Well, I mean she kinda covers that's really good actually. What is she? She's a barbarian. Oh yeah. Wow. We Hmm. This is this might actually be a good party because I can cover stealth stuff for the most part as a monk, 
bestial heart. She just can't speak with animals. Of course she did. Oh hell yeah! Oh, if I mean, you, we'll if, definitely want to. If I pick wild heart between wild heart berserker and wild magic, berserker is pretty fucking good. Melee attack was a bonus action. Enraged throw. Pick up an item or creature and throw it at the target. Frenzy. Wild magic. It's not like a sorcerer thing. Causing a random magic effect. It totally is like the sorcerer thing, but without the normal yeah. benefit of why you would want that. There we go. Now she's le now she's level three. Nice. And I'm in pain. Let's fuck up some paladins. Some fake paladins. Morally ambiguous paladin impersonators. Unless she's lying. In which case, <laughs> well. Yeah, my character's a monk. I think I'm a, I'm a gith monk. I think my character's totally fine with fucking up some people who want to start a fight. Let's see. Hunt, oh, hunt the devil, confront the paladins. Go up here? Oh my god, there's so many camp supplies. Dead gnolls. Whatever killed those gnolls might be nearby. Careful. See, can I examine the gnolls? Examine. Oh, there's still there dead There are a lot of gnolls. Oh, there are some still... still dead when still, I examine them. There's still some alive ones down here. Oh, did you start fighting? And not fighting? gnolls, I mean like sad hyena babies that are crying because they're dying. What? <laughs> Why are there yeah. sad hyena babies? Where the f- How do I tell where people are in this game? Look on your map? I know, I'm like, I'm- I don't- see you and I'm looking at oh you're like invisible oh weird I guess if I scroll my map over to you it still won't show you even though you're my party you were, just, you were just invisible when I scrolled over to where that spot was oh no they're just regular hyenas creature's eyes roll back in its head equal parts bliss and agony bliss feasted and yet looking into her eyes you can see it wasn't enough. She's still hungry. What? Come, see, my flesh becomes new flesh. Oh, they're all gonna turn into gnolls. Um. You hear what comes next before you see it. The sharp snapping of bones and a yelp of pain as her body starts to twist and undulate. You gotta Watch kill it. Cold realization. This isn't the end of one life, but the start of another. Gnolls, vicious, monstrous humanoids, can spawn from the corpses of dying hyenas. What, what the fuck? <laughs> you gotta, you gotta kill him. This is unacceptable gnoll lore. <laughs> this is distressing. Destroy the abomination. You land a swift strike against her skull. She yelps, then goes still. As the life fades from her eyes, the gnoll within her dies too, stillborn. Mm. Um. Oh. All right. <laughs> oh, these are wild. Is there like one combat <laughs> hyena and the rest are all just like stuck on the floor? Bloated hyenas. This is upsetting. We're gonna what need to I, kill them all. What am I looking at? Yinogu's hunger. Oh, that's like the super hyena. That's like the name of like the super knoll or something. Okay. What is the name of the super knoll? Uh, the Yinogu or whatever the the oh, the buff gotcha. they all have. Oh, Yinogu's hunger. Gotcha. Yeah, we cannot let these things transform. That one's trying to and get away. And we can't let that one get away. Oh, there are gnolls up here. Less damage than I would uh, hope. Okay. Oh, 
Oh yeah, those are whole those are whole ass knolls all just gorging on one thing. Uh, yeah. We do not want to let those three wake up. Oh, uh, no. they're walking. They're done eating that thing. They're gonna go eat that one now. Uh. Mm. Uh huh. What? <laughs> Noel Fang of Yinogu. These things are gonna hit hard. They don't have a lot of HP, but they are definitely gonna hit hard. I might be in a bit of trouble for getting off path. Oh no. It's fine. This is gonna feel good. Uh, let's see. Oh god. Time to learn how to play a barbarian. Piercing shot, lacerate, <laughs> ranged attack. Legacy of Avernus, Searing Smite, Evocation Smell. A bunch of damage once per long rest. Set your target on fire. Thaumaturgy, gain advantage on intimidation and performance checks. Uh, have a big swing. Reckless attack is an action. Turn next turn, you have advantage on attack rolls, but enemies have advantage against you. Oh, frenzy! You your rage turns into a frenzy. You gain frenzied strike and enraged throw. You can also use improvised weapon attack as a bonus action. Frenzied strike. Just a lot of buttons to unpack about what they'll do. Uh, it's a lot of bonus action abilities. I don't think I can make her go faster. So she's kind of far away right now. I think I just have to spend the turn running towards the fight. You can throw stuff if you have a bonus action. Or she has a long range weapon, it looks like. You can you can yeah. probably hit the null. Or the hyena. Because an enraged throw requires me to be enraged. Oh, yeah. Going into a rage is pretty powerful. It's something that you want to do pretty often with a barbarian. Frenzy says your rage turns to a frenzy, so it's not the rage button. Do you press a button to go into a rage? Typically, um, going into a rage is like, it's basically like a stance, kind of. Rage charge. Number of times you can enter a rage. Is that... Okay. I guess the far, I guess frenzy is is your rage. It's just the fact that they phrase it as your rage turns into a frenzy, frenzy sounds confusing, but that's what uses my rage charges. Okay, let's see how that goes. So that uses up my bonus action, which means I won't be able to do something else for my bonus action. Hmm. If those guys don't aggro, it's probably not worth using a of rage. Cause I only get three. It should be fine. You should be okay. It's very. I mean, it is. It is useful to have. But if they don't aggro, yes, we shouldn't go into it. So you should save it for when or if they they aggro. Come on, can't stay idle. Okay. Uh, okay. No, it's saved. Ugh. Wait, only I six really more health. Do I want to action surge? I only get it once per short rest. Let's do it. Whose idea was it that fucking hyenas just gorge on corpses until they explode into a knoll? <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Uh... You get half your movement back. Now get closer to the other hyenas so that we can kill them before they, uh, before they activate. Before they pop. Yep. Let's go. Let's see. Yeah. 
Yeah, I, don't, I didn't get a turn. Oh, weird. It should have given you your movement back. At least a little bit of it. Movement increase, it, it, movement speed increased by half and doesn't provoke opportunity attacks. It doesn't necessarily say that you would gain movement from from scratch. Oh, weird. That's what, uh, cause that, cause that's what a, uh, a thing is. Okay, perfect. Okay, uh, let's... Oh, that's fire wine, so that will light on fire. I wasn't trying to do that. Don't go up there. Don't trigger the gnolls. <laughs> I was picking up the book. Oh, okay, good. Do we want to talk to Carlac? There are a lot of dead caravan angels. Oh. Hey, we're still going after those paladins, right? Can't leave Zariel's bruisers roaming the coast. Yeah, we'll, we'll do it. Yeah, sorry, just uh, intense ADHD. Uh... <laughs> Right, don't worry. We'll go after them. Good news. Can't wait to see them finished. Better find somewhere to camp soon. Bro, we just camped. Hyena ear. Yes, I will gladly take this alchemical ingredient. I'm valuable alchemically? Best be on my way. I do want those potatoes. Die, potato. Okay. We got pretty much everything that there was to get here. We're good. Uh, so the reason why I went down here to begin with is because uh, there is a... There was a ton of camp supplies on the ground. So I was like, oh, okay, this actually benefits us to grab all these because we are actually very low on camp supplies. <laughs> Deliver the chest to me unopened. Read the first sentence again. Open it and I will know, because you will be dead. This is not a threat. This is what will happen if you open the chest. NF. Is the- was it somehow hyenas? <laughs> oh. I don't think I saw a chest at the shipment. I didn't see anything- I don't see a chest here. I wonder if it was Ooh. hyenas. <laughs>